Hello and welcome to St Peter's Church. Uh, I'm Dean and this is Katie. Um, Debbie is away for the week so um, a few different people are doing Compline this week uh, and Mike Gillingham is also kindly going to do morning prayer on Wednesday so keep an eye out for the videos for the week. Uh, I'm doing today and tomorrow and I think Katie's going to be joining me for both. Uh, so, good evening and welcome. <laughs> the Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord. Who made heaven and earth. Most merciful God, we, we confess, confess to you before, before the whole, whole company, company of heaven and, and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed. And, and in what we have failed to do, forgive us our sins, heal us by your Spirit, and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and, and to the, the Son, and, and to the Holy Spirit, as, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Before the ending of the day, creator of the world, we pray that you with steadfast love would keep your watch around us while we sleep. From evil dreams defend our sight, from fears and terrors of the night. Tread underfoot our deadly foe, that we no sinful fault may know. O Father, that we ask be done, through Jesus Christ, your only Son. And Holy Spirit, by whose breath our souls are raised to life from death. Psalm 4 Answer me when I call, O God of my righteousness. You set me at liberty when I was in trouble. Have mercy on me and hear my prayer. How long will you nobles dishonour my glory? How long will you love vain things and seek after falsehood? But know that the Lord has shown me his marvellous kindness. When I call upon the Lord, he will hear me. Stand in awe and sin not. Commune with your own heart upon your bed and be still. Offer the sacrifices of righteousness and put your trust in the Lord. There are many that say, who will show us any good? Lord, lift up the light of your countenance upon us. You have put gladness in my heart, more than when their corn and wine and oil increase. In peace I will lie down and sleep, for it is you, Lord, only who make me dwell in safety. Glory, Glory to, to the Father, and, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Thus said the Lord God, the Holy One of Israel, in returning and rest you shall be saved, in quietness and in trust shall be your strength. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend our spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, Lord God of truth. I commend my spirit. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Keep me as the apple of your eye. Hide me under the shadow of your wings. Save, Save us, O Lord, while waking. waking. And guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and the sleep may rest in peace. Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation, which you have prepared in the sight of every people. A light to reveal you to the nations, and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to, to the, the Father, and, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. We're going to have a short time of prayer. Merciful God, 
we entrust to your unfailing and tender care this night, those who are ill or are in pain, knowing that whenever danger threatens, your everlasting arms are there to hold us safe, comfort and heal them, and restore them to health and strength through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Be present, O merciful God, and protect us through the silent hours of this night, so that we who are wearied by the changes and chances of this fleeting world may rest upon your eternal changelessness through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Lord, visit this place, we pray, and drive far from it the snares of the enemy. May your holy angels dwell with us in peace, and may your blessings be always upon us, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. Lord, I pray for Debbie this week. Pray for Debbie's dad this week. Lord, be with them. Lord, guide them. Lord, give them strength. Give them everything they need. Lord, be with all other clergy. Be with all those around the world that are struggling with the pandemic. Lord, we may be coming to what seems to be the end. But for so many, this is just the beginning or a re-emergence of it. Lord, protect all those that are working with those suffering. Give them the strength, wisdom and knowledge to help all those suffering, Lord. Lord, we pray for all those in power in this country and in all the others around the world, especially in America, Lord. Lord, open your arms, rain your Holy Spirit and love on us all. May we then share your love May we sleep well, wake rested. Amen. Amen. Almighty and everlasting God, by whose spirit the whole body of the church is governed and sanctified, hear our prayer which we offer for all your faithful people, that in their vocation and ministry they may serve you in the holiness and truth, to the glory of your name through our lord and saviour jesus christ who is alive and reigns with you in the unity of the holy spirit one god now and forever amen, amen. we'll say the lord's prayer our, our father, father in, in heaven, heaven hallowed be your name your, your kingdom, kingdom come your will be done on, on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins, as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power and the glory are yours, now and forever. Amen. In peace we lie down and sleep. For you alone, Lord, make us dwell in safety. Abide with us, Lord Jesus. For the night is at hand and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. Come with the dawning of the day. And make yourself known in the breaking of the bread. The Lord bless us and watch over us. The Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look kindly on us and give us peace. Amen. Amen. Thank you for joining us for Evening Compline. Uh, I hope it hasn't been too painful and you haven't missed Debbie too much. Uh, I'm sure she will be back with you as soon as possible after she's rested and recuperated.
Thank you again from me, Dean, and from me, Katie. Uh, and we'll see you again tomorrow. Good night and God bless.